Hello you guys, happy Tuesday. It is currently August 1st, happy August. I am so excited to start this new month. We finally reached a thousand subscribers, you guys. I am so happy, excited, and grateful, thankful, all the things. Um, as you can see, I got my beautiful cash tray here from Funds and Fun on Etsy. Um, and I have the giveaway winner, which I will announce in this video. So, before that though, I am going to tell you I don't have a debt update. I'm still, 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 still trying to figure out what's going on with my loan. I have an appointment at the bank at 1245. It is like 10 o'clock right now. So, I will be going and figuring out what's going on with that. I think something happened and, um, yeah, but that's okay if something did happen it's all gonna work out. I'll explain more once I know more. Um, but I do have $4,500 set aside to put towards debt and I am just like so anxious and ready to put that towards my debt. That can completely pay off one of my high interest cards right now. So like that can be knocked out, which is amazing. I'm just waiting for guidance from the bank to figure out what to do. Anyway, um, let's jump into this cash stuffing. So, should I go ahead and announce the giveaway winner? I don't know if I should announce it or do people wait till the end? I guess I'll just wait till the end. That extremely loud noise that you hear is the water pump. They are currently watering the flowers outside in the plants. So, it should turn off here in about 10 seconds and hopefully stop. <laughs> um, so sorry about that. There we go. So starting off with groceries, um, as you guys may know, I am going on my trip to Boone and to Raleigh. I love this cash tray. I am so in love with this. This is my first time like using it. You know, I like put the money in there, but this is my first time grabbing the money out of it and I am loving it. Anyway, I'm going on my trip to Boone and Raleigh this week, so I want to have $50 for groceries for my trip to Boone. In Raleigh, I'll probably eat out most likely, um, but I want to have $50 on top of the money that I already saved. So we're putting $50 in groceries. Eating out is going to get $30. Oh, we already have a little bit of good money in there. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. The Airbnb is fully booked until August 20th. So I am completely stoked about that. And I got this white um, background. It's a desk mat. I got it from Amazon for like $10 or something. I am stuffing gas station snacks this week, you guys. I'm putting $15 in there because I will be on the road and wanting some gas station snacks so that is finally getting some money fifteen dollars going in there car wash is getting skipped this week i think i have some money in here i have a couple of dollars a dollar um i do need to go to the car wash oh my gosh that terrible noise i'm so sorry please bear with me through that but i do need to go to the car wash um before i go on my trip Shopping is getting 48, and we have 20 in there right now. 20, 40, 5, 6, 7, 8. I am obsessed with this cash tray. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 5, 66, 67, 68, which should be enough for like a cute top or something if I find one while I'm in Raleigh. And the miscellaneous is getting skipped. I think we have some money in there, though. Yeah, we've got like 12 or so dollars in there. That does it for my everyday wallet. Next up is our short-term goals. And rent is getting its usual 100. I cannot believe that it is August. I am just really excited for the month and good things are happening. So, rent is getting $100 and I have a bunch of 
just like exciting things this month. Like I'm going on this trip this week and then I have my family reunion in New York that I'm going on. Airbnb Needs is getting 10% of this week's earnings, so it's getting 147. And I bought that new TV last week and it was only 265, which is pretty good for a 55 inch, I feel like. I do not know how much that's going to be, so let's add it and count it up. 20, 40, five six seven so we have an airbnb needs one two hundred twenty forty fifty two fifty five fifty six fifty seven fifty eight fifty nine sixty 262. I am debating if I should get that vacuum. I don't know. It's like I could use my friend's vacuum in the meantime, but like what else am I saving for right now? There are things that I want to do to the place. I won't get into too much detail and bore you. And I do want to have a little bit of a buffer. So I just don't know if I should use that money yet to buy the parts for my vacuum. Entertainment is getting $20, so we will be at $40. I am going to a concert tomorrow, so I'll probably end up taking all of this money out um, to pay myself back for the concert that I'm going to for, like, drinks and stuff. I already bought my ticket with the money that was in here, but I will need to pay myself back. Pet Things is getting $10. I'm trying to get in the habit of getting my dog groomed often, and he already has his next appointment. So I need to stay on top of this. And he just got groomed, and he already has a hot spot. If you guys know why hot spots happen on dogs, let me know because I'm so lost and confused. Like, he's as clean as can be, and he got a freaking hot spot. So I have no idea. 20, 30, 40, 50. And next, self-care is getting $10 as well. So it should have $210 in there. $120, 40 60 70 80 90 $210. Perfect. Um, I'm so happy that I reached the thousand subscriber mark that I've been trying to reach. It still won't let me apply to like be a YouTube creator, but that's okay. Maybe it will let me in a couple days. I don't know. I really think I would only make like $10 probably a month from YouTube if that, um, but I don't know. I just think it would still be cool. So we're adding 50 into occasions for my trip. And I'm debating whether I should put this money in my bank account or keep it in cash. I still have not exactly decided on that. I think I'll keep some in cash and put some in my bank account. But we have 150, 250, 70, 90, 310, 330, 350, 370, 380, 390, 400. Perfect. I am very excited for this trip. I got all my snacks and my special drinks and everything ready to go. Um, so I am ready. Well, I haven't packed or anything, but I have everything that I need. Medical is getting 10. Oh, and very exciting news. I've been waiting to, I think I've mentioned this before, but I've been selling clothes at the retail shop that I work at, like my own clothes, selling them. Um, 
at the retail place that I work at and um, I'm so close to hitting like profiting $2,000 and once I hit $2,000 I'm going to cash out. I'm literally like $15 away. So I'm hoping when I get back from my trip I can cash out on that and do like a nice big cash stuffing of that money but that is very exciting news. Medical has 1, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. I feel so lucky that I was able to do that. I tried to sell my clothes like on Poshmark and on like my Instagram stories and I did pretty well actually on my Instagram like specifically for my clothes but yeah like I had a lot left over and I've sold 117 pieces of clothing I think it was so that's a lot and that's very exciting. Home insurance is fully funded, so we are skipping that this week and taking a little break. Oh, by the way, we're cash stuffing $840. I probably should have mentioned that before. Car maintenance is going to get $30. And oh my gosh, you guys, I have my new trackers. Aren't they beautiful? They're from Lily Budgets. I think they are like the most beautiful things. So, 600 in the bank. Oh, wait, let me add the money first. $30. I did not make a lot. I don't even want to get into it about this week with Instacart and stuff. I don't even want to get into it. Just know I did not make a lot of money this week, which is very unusual, but it is what it is, and we're moving on. So, 600 in the bank, 700, 800, 20, 40, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, 757? No. 8, 20, 40, 857? Something like that. I'll recount it and fill out my tracker later. You guys know what I said. That's what's important. Bet Savings is getting $50. I still have not heard back from the insurance company, but it does take like three days for them to accept the claim and then five to 10 business days for them to review the claim. So 100 in the bank, 200, 250, 270, 290. Oh dang, we're already back at 300, so that's good. And the thing about my pet insurance claim is I realized he hasn't had anything wrong with him except for at the beginning of this year. And our insurance like restarted, I think, in March. He hasn't really had anything wrong with him since March. And um, his deductible is 250 So I think the money that I paid is going to go towards his deductible. So... Don't think I'll be seeing that money, but hopefully when we get this big $300 test done, I will be seeing the money from that and getting that back. So 20, 40, 50, 65 and holidays, which when I do my big cash stuffing for the clothes that I sold, I'll be putting a lot of money into there. And that'll be mainly for my sister's birthday, which I'm buying her and myself tattoos um, for her birthday. Black Friday is just getting a little $5 this week. It has 20, 40, 60, 85, which is fine by me. Like I said, even if I don't even participate in Black Friday this year, it's okay. That would just be like a little treat to myself if I can make that happen. Okay, winter savings is getting 40. You guys, I'm going to say it one more time. I love this cash tray, okay? So, 600 in the bank, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 700 dollars. Which is great. And hopefully when I do my little cash stuffing that I keep talking about from selling my clothes, we can hit a thousand in this. Vacation is getting $50. 20, 40. And 50. So it has 500 in the bank, 600, 20, 40, 
60, 70, 80, 90, 700. Is that how much was in winter savings? They must both be at 700. I did have to take $350 out of this for my flight to New York, so that's why it's a little behind right now. Taxes is getting $15. Again, don't even want to get into this past week. Um with my Instacart little side gig, but yeah. So 600 in the bank and 15, 16, 17. 617, which I would like to see it higher, but that's okay for now. Oh, I just realized I forgot to put money into giving. It has $20 in it right now, and I'll do that next week for giving. I totally forgot to put money in there, but that's okay. We will put money in it next week. So this week was kind of a slower week, not actually a slower week, just like as far as getting cash in hand at the end of the night went. Um, and my Monday payout wasn't that big from last week because I got more cash last week. Anyway, my Monday payout for next week should be pretty good. So this week I just ended up with 485. Did I write how much I made this week? Let's see. Yes, I did. I made $1,068 this week total, and I only worked three nights, so that's pretty good. But in my Save $500 challenge, we are putting $95, and that is doing a row. There's a random 55 here, like most amounts only go up to 30. I think 35 is the next highest amount, so we're just knocking that out this week. And we are putting 20, 40, 60, 80, 95. Oh, wait. Whoops. So, save $500 challenge has 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60, 70, 85. 185. Oh my god, I missed a 200. That's very exciting. Save $700 challenge is getting 50. I'm going to cross off the 225s. So 20, 40, and 50. And you may notice we're out of money now because I already completed my $2,000 savings challenge off camera. Because I wanted to put that money into the bank to get ready to, for my meeting today. Um, so yeah, I already completed that. And yay, so excited. I wrote the little date. It did take me a long time because I took months and months off of cash stuffing. Um, I think I was like up to here or here, maybe here, when I stopped after I started in February. But um yeah, maybe next time around it won't take me as long, which will be fun to see. Anyway, in Save 700, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 135, which I think I'm going to start doing three a week um, because I like counted out how many weeks it would take me and I would finish this one like four weeks before I finished this one and I want to finish them at the same time. So I might start doing three a week on the save $700 challenge. But okay, I guess I need to announce the winner, you guys. And I'm so bad about this. I probably should have written this down. But I want to say the winner's name is I have a screenshot it on my phone, but I know I can't like look it up while I'm recording the video and I don't want to edit this. I use like a random giveaway comment picker on the internet and I want to say it's Prosperous Budgeting or Prosperous Budgets, but she is the winner. She left a really sweet comment about like how fast life changes and I thought that was really cool that she won because I really liked her comment. So she is the winner of our giveaway. I will tag her below as well so she will see this, but um, yes, and she gets this beautiful cash tray. I have the other one somewhere over there um all wrapped up still so i will have her email me and um her dress and send that out to her and yes very exciting and i 
will talk to you guys. You guys, I'm going to be in Boone and Raleigh until like Monday of next week. So I'll try to do a cash stuffing Tuesday, but I might do it Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday. We'll see. But I will talk to you guys sometime next week. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys. Bye.